three, Daniel. go! Welcome to my channel. My name is Daisy, and today we are going on a tour here in Ghana. But anyways, my friend gonna tell you where we're going. Hi, uh, those you are going to Ako Sombo in the eastern region. guys we're in shy hills we're just touched down in or tour and it's like wild monkey all around so guys I will show you guys what I will show you guys what shy hill is about we're about to go on a tour and they're gonna talk much about the place so let's walk around we're waiting on a tour guide to check in and then we're gonna get a tour guide to show us around and educate us about the place so we are in the center where you checked in and wait for your tour guide and the monkeys are just like walking around so cute they are very dangerous animals they can even kill human beings Mm. Yeah. Where is this? No, they have attacked me before. I, I ran and climbed a tree before I was sick. Oh, wow. okay. And the female will come on heat for about three months. Hey. When it is on heat, it becomes very aggressive. Three months? Yeah. So how do you satisfy us? He's a woman, you can't satisfy us. I'm joking. I'm joking. That's a joke. That's definitely a joke. When you get inside, you hang about to go and feed it. You. It's an ostrich, yeah, right? What is it? Oh, thanks. So cute. No, <laughs> So we are off to see zebra, guys. It is so gorgeous. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Wow. Oh, wait, wait, let me show you guys. Wait. Oh, look how gorgeous it is. Wow. 
first we imported uh, 15 zebras and only seven survived because the weather here is too hot for them and the seven they have given birth to two so now we are having nine zebras and let me see the young ones are just here they are just a year old one year old yeah, These so are huge to be one year old. They're so cute. Yeah, that one moving over there. One year old. Yeah, just one year old. And zebras too. We have uh, different types. We have the plain zebras and mountain zebras. So these are called the plain zebras. The plain zebras, the white in them is not pure than the mountain zebra. So you see this one is like brownish color. So these are the plain zebras. And then we feed them with also the feed, uh, feed brown. They take the feet brown and the grasses too. They take the grasses as well. And when they are in the fence like this, they grow for 50 years. But when they are in the wild, they grow for 20 or 30 years because lions can feed on them. Yes. So now we're having nice zebras right now. Oh, the male, you can see they are. They are. Yeah. Wait, what do you see? Uh, you see the appendix. The oh, appendix, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. So as we are going, you will see the royal python. I what hope you can hold the royal what python. What is the royal python? Yeah. What's that? Uh, we have a python in the cage. What is that? Uh, it's called a royal python. No, but what is a royal python? Uh, they are a, a, a snake. Oh, yeah. okay. And there are no uh, any poison in them. But there, there's no poison in them. So oh, okay. when tourists come, they use it to hold, they hold them. I'm talking about python. I'm talking about python. No, no, no. When we come here to this uh, crocodile, this is a giant cat. We have them here. But uh, they always deep inside the forest. So it's hard for you to see them. And this is the scar of uh, until for the cops. And then say it's okay. So we're at the Museum of Nature and Cultural Heritage, Shy Hill. So this is the museum area. Wall of skin. And is a water skull, a zebra skull. And this is the antelope skull. So as we are going inside, we see more of the antelope this type. We have about more than 500 inside the forest. This is an original ostrich egg. And this is a feather of the ostrich. And then this is the elephant, I think he said, but it's not the original one. And then this is a cheetah, original skin, but it's not a real one. So nice. Oh, I just see all these animals on the bottom. Ooh. My camera had to start over, so I think they embalmed the real animals here and this is how they could make these like the eggs but they're in like water well i guess it's not water but things to drench them out wow they have such a lot in the bottom this is so cool This is a shy hill map. Wait, wait, well, you, wait. You feel the touch before. Okay. Yeah. All right. It doesn't bite. Okay. They, they only swallow and they can't swallow you. You are bigger uh, than it. It's the yeah. no, Don't leave it. Hold okay. it. Yeah.
about to climb up the rock to see the whole overview of it. We're heading up to see the rock. Oh wow, I don't know how would I make it up there now. That looks tragic. But well, that looks really tragic. Oh, if that lady can do it, we can do it. Wow. That is where we're going with that lady. Wow. Wow. on the bottom. I'm just so scared of heights. I keep looking that way and trying to look at the lens. But I'm so scared of heights and it's kind of wet so I'm kind of scared but it looks really nice. Like let me turn the camera around. That's the rope going up there. But I'm scared because it's wet. So guys, um, we did a tour with a local Ghanaian tour guide. He have like a tour with, you know, he put up a certain days and then he get a group of people and then he do a tour. So he had a tour for November 19th, which is today. And it's a bunch of us. He rented a bus, he have drinks, he have toilet paper, he had um, water, he had snacks. Wi-Fi on the bus and it costs us 350 CD per person which is like 20 something dollars US dollars which is really good the customer service the bus the AC um, the water the Wi-Fi it's fun and they educate, educate us a lot about the childhood area um, and just where we're touring at and I feel like it really worth it because if you hire a personal tour guide to take you around this will cost you like hundred and eighty dollars to two hundred and fifty sixty dollars when I was checking around so I tell my friend like oh I see this group tour that is happening here let's get on it so it's Afrianka tour I will leave their Instagram and their website in the bio so it's a f r o y a f r o n y a n k a dot com or just Afroyanka Tours on Instagram. I will just leave that information in the bio. He do personal tours too, private tours, group tours, career trips, and fine accommodation and all that. That's really really nice. So this is a nice tour and it definitely worth it, especially if you're on a budget. But anyways, let's get back to the to the view. It's that way of the hill. And I am going down from this way, the way we um, get up, the first way we went up. So, yeah, I'm heading back down. I think they're going that way. But yeah. <laughs> I just don't like, if it was not raining, I'd probably go, but I'm very clumsy, so I'm so scared. Even though I have on gym shoes, I didn't feel like climbing up. Oh, I heard them like right here. I didn't hear them right there. <gasps> hey, how would I get back down? Whew. Guys, 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 guys. So, I gotta find my way. Wait, 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 wait. Let me turn the camera around. I gotta find my way back down here. I think I'll go on that rope instead of this area let me try this way to get back down from here and hold this okay okay oh it wasn't that bad I should have went after all okay 
Okay. Okay. So we're at the Royal Sanji stop where we're gonna get some food and it's just a pit stop and then we could continue on to the boat cruise and the Akosamba Bridge and all that so yeah. I don't know if the food is free but he said get food here. That's what he no, said. No, no, no. I, I've asked Chris. I don't think it's going to be free. Right? We're gonna have to buy. Yeah, you have to. I either want tilapia or I want banco with tilapia and pepe. Or if not red red with fry fish. But yeah, how are you liking the trip so far, Daniel? Uh, so far, this has been the best out of the ones that we've been to. The hustle here in uh, Village Falls, right? Yeah. It's, it's, it's much more calm. Like the security staff cooperate with you and then they ask you questions reasonably and then like you sort things out reasonably. Not like everywhere they came with list and all those things. And I have loved this one so far. I'm really loved it. I'm hoping to see what uh, Apostle has to offer us. <laughs> you heard it, guys? So, with the Royal Sanji, this place looks so nice. with a husband this one Moet. hey Charlie it's expensive now let's see the regular price of the 4.5k no, these are just drinks oh just are drinks just drinks, drinks menu the bar, the bar, the bar. oh it's not that it's cheap then it's not that bad okay oh yeah the normal ones okay okay so these are the price for the drinks not that bad but I don't know what about these prices these prices are expensive <laughs> This is the back of the Royal Senji. We're trying to eat, but the food here seems pricey. Do you eat breakfast? No. Okay, and here's too expensive for you. I mean, it's okay, but they didn't have what I want. Okay, they, so this. They have spring rolls. I'll get some of those to hold me. Okay, so this is what I'm saying. That's a long time, though. That's a problem. When we go to Continental, we're going to go on a boat ride, and the boat ride is about 30 minutes. So, so now, oh. listen to me. When we get there and you order food, it's probably going to take you 30 minutes to one hour to get your food. So we order the food and go So we order the food, we'll go for the boat ride, we'll come back, the food is ready. Doesn't make sense. But we could grab a snack or That's something. Oh yeah, sure, you can grab something. Can okay. Yeah. It'll be on the way. Mm -hmm. okay. Here at the Royal Century, like, so gorgeous. It's a nice day trip. You know, eat here, chill here, would be so cool. But the price of the food here is a little bit pricey on the pricey side, but it's really nice. It's really cute. I think uh, Ghanaians, the Ghanaians here will tell us what they know about them. They can tell us something they know about them. I know that it was built by J.J. Rollins. Okay, good one. Uh -huh. uh, good one. Uh, not, it was built out okay. of Meta. Oh, Meta. Okay. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. I know J.J. Rollins, he drives very pain with go past him. Exactly. Sandra. I don't understand English. <laughs> All right. Oh, sorry. So, I don't understand. Hey. Hey. My, my that's, that's one of the... Uh, what did he say? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, our former president uh, and late president Jerry John Rawlings, who yeah, was yeah, a military yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, he used the private jet and flew under this oh, bridge. Okay. It is not that uh, the altitude is not that high, but then he managed to, you know, uh, fly under it. 
and people, you know, are like, wow, wow. Mm -hmm. So this is that bridge you are here to see. This is that bridge. Let's Wait do it. Pieces. And now we're finally here at the Akosombo Bridge. Let's see. Just so pretty. And then. Oh my god, Ghana is just so gorgeous. That is the bridge. That is the bridge. It's so gorgeous. It's so pretty. It is so nice. And this is a bridge. Akutombo. Oh, this place is just so gorgeous, like, wow. You get off the bus, you have uh, people here selling stuff. If you need a motor ride, you check this guy out, he will give you a motor ride if you need a motor ride when you come to Kosombo. Motor rides, motor rides. Or if you need like foods and stuff, the ladies are selling food right after you get off the bus. You can get food, you can get motor rides, you can get whatever. I just love how it's just luscious and green and palm trees and beautiful. But anyways, we're walking back to the bus. They're waiting on us. Here you could get the ladies selling cloth and more stuff like wow look at all this nice here you can get cloths you can get water you get all kind of whatever you want here that's yeah, Marin told that is the last bit a bowl. Ah. Oh, that looks yummy. What is it? Shrimps. Shrimps. It's so huge. Oh my God. So pretty. So we're about to stop at this place to eat and take a boat ride from here to what's the name of this place? So it's the Continental Hotel. I remember here, I stayed here one time when I came to Akosamba before. It's really nice, it has a really nice view of the pool and everything. And the food is really good too, because I, I tried the food too before. So yeah, I'm about to eat and then I'll show you guys the boat tour and all that that is going on next. So today the tour was amazing with Afrianka tour. We had a really good time. That tour, that exploring Ghana was one of the best experience. Good customer service. Night meet nice people. We didn't really have an issue with her drone shot, with her 
with her photos with you know professional camera blah 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 it was really 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 good they had water drinks juice like it was everything was smooth and nice i really appreciate that tour so i didn't vlog end of the night because it was so dark after we leave the restaurant and heading back over to accra it was really 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 dark so i just ended this morning guys please make sure you like subscribe comment below let me know what you think about this vlog and what region you want to see me go next in ghana bye guys see you in the other vlog